because I don't hate it. I just don't have any feelings for it at all. Okay. Yeah, I didn't hate it, but uh, you know, I have to admit the one character that did keep me laughing throughout this whole thing who we haven't really talked about was uh, Carlos the the. The oh, little, we talked the, about the chick. You, 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 you talked about you the, said the little it was chick, racist. The little chick, but I mean, I thought he was the funniest thing in the movie. As far as a villain goes, I mean, I was disappointed that they didn't throw more of an, more of him in there because I would think it would have made a, a far more interesting movie. Um, but other than that, yeah, Russell Brand didn't bother me. That that character, yeah, if they gave him something to do. Um, the animation of the character was so good that you know, yeah, it's it, it's a pretty cool character. And if like, wow, if they if they just did something more with this, it could have been something. But just a lot of wasted potential with this film. And uh, I mean, but you know what? I did I did laugh more than I did watching Wimpy Kid. And uh, I'd give it a rental. Yeah, you know, I, you know that's true. I did mm. laugh more than I, which would be probably once. <laughs> <in this. laughs> I laughed a couple of times. I laughed every like, time that fucking chicken was on the that, that chicken was on the screen. See, I was, yeah. See, and the black guys. made me laugh. And the black guys. He yeah. was the one that on oh, the black guys. <laughs> <laughs> ain't, like, ain't no comment like blind oh, black man. Oh no. <laughs> nah, you know. Um, uh, uh, yeah, I did laugh a few times in this. I, I'm thinking about uh, even James Marsden. I'm not saying he was bad. I remember James Marsden in like uh, Sex Drive, yeah. where he was like really good. Yeah. You know, it's uh, just it's just another case where actors. That it's like they they know that they're doing a kids movie. It's almost so like they, actors they, they who get too much. get hired to do a, a really bad comic book movie. They realize they're in a comic book movie, so it gives them some kind of liberty to just act like silly. Well, so. they just mug their way exaggeratedly through it, yeah. which a decent director wouldn't let them do. Right, that. and I think. You're the right. Our biggest problem here is just that you've got a guy who can't do anything but these types of films. Yes. Even though I, every time the animated, I mean, because there is live action and and CG sure. uh, where I wanted to see more of the CG. I was like, you know, this should have been just a CG animated feature. Yeah, that probably would have helped it a little it bit more too. would have helped a lot. Yeah. yeah. You know, uh, a little bit of cleverness going on mm. there. Like I said, it wasn't a total waste. I, I did like the Playboy matching joke. Mm-hmm. I thought that that was pretty funny. But, uh, you know, if you want to know who's probably losing the biggest there is Jesus. I mean, <laughs> Jesus is like Christmas ain't about Jesus anymore. It's about Santa Claus. He ain't got that. Yeah. Well, hell, now that, I mean, even even when something is about Jesus, it's always sad and tragic. It's about how his parents had to sleep in a fucking barn. He was born out there. Or it's about how he's getting his ass beat How he got the killed. shit beat out of him. And I mean, now. Those are his two stories. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> the thing is with Easter, it's the most interesting story. It's where zombie Jesus comes back from the right. grave to yeah. wreak havoc on the world. And that's, yeah. uh, why not? Why can't you make an animated movie on that for the kid, on the that's for the true. children and teach them some history? Why should yeah. totally animate Jesus Christ Vampire Hunter. <laughs> I mean, why can't somebody other than the Monty Python troupe do a, a humorous uh, resurrection scene. I agree with you. Yeah. People like watch religious films at Easter and they should watch. I, and I generally concur because they're a lot better than this movie. I mean, fuck, I'm just going to watch the Ten Commandments again. Yeah. This came out on Blu ray and that's a great Yeah, movie. yeah, that, that, that's, uh, that's actually the Easter. I'm movie. with you on this, man. It's like Jesus needs to take his shit back. He's getting yes, upstage by an old man and a rabbit. I'm yeah. like, hey, man, you need to hurry up and make that zombie hey, movie because uh, no <laughs> <shit. you> know, <laughs> we're losing track of who you I are, know. man. Uh, Jesus needs to start like delivering yeah. eggs or something. No, that, yeah, it needs to be Jesus for coming back from the dead, watching all these fucking movies about all his holidays that don't re- ever re- refer to him at all. He's just like, you know, fuck this. I'm fucking taking out everybody. Yeah, I'm taking my shit back. Yeah. Sure, we can come back like Elmer Fudd start hunting rabbits. Yeah. <laughs> it's all about candy. Don't eat that. You might not like the flavor. Fred, relax. Watermelon. Chicks. Can I at least touch it? Ow! There. We touched it. Thank you. And rock and roll. Stop! Stop! I didn't like it. I loved it. Huh. Look at this. <gasps> Look how cute this stuffed bunny is. Aww. Oh, he's so soft and cute and cuddly and 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 warm. She's seeing anyone? No, she's single and she's looking for a rabbit. 